everybody, it's me again. Uh, we're back to look at the crab, and this time I'm gonna try to show you how to handle one of these guys. Now, yes, I am wearing gardening gloves. Um, these are very strong crabs. We're just gonna say hello. Now, she may, tr they will attempt to snap at you. This tends to be their first warning. I say one of the best ways is coming underneath them and just kind of letting them hang. Now, as I said, these are very strong crabs and she will let you know this. When you handle them, you want to be very, very careful and cautious. You want her to know that you're not going to harm her, but you still want her to know that you are the boss. If you just let her sit there for a minute, They'll start to become a little less moody. Now with crabs, they are very sensitive to their movement. So if you'd like to see them, you gotta be very, very cautious. Just very sweet and calm. And let them go at their own leisure. They are very, very skittish. And they will try to attack you for the first couple for the first couple of days they will attempt to get you. Sometimes even for the first couple of months. But that's why you gotta let them get to know ya. Uh, one thing with handling these crabs is you never ever want to drop them. They should always be secure in some fashion, whether that's them securing onto you via their legs or you're holding them either way they need to be cared with with the utmost caution even though she's covered in armor she is still a fragile being Treat her as if she was a delicate insect. Now, what we're also going to be doing today, later on, is we are going and we're going to let her dig now. Always give them a good chance to just dig back home. They are very big diggers. So the next thing we're going to do is we're actually going to be rebuilding this whole habitat to be specifically, well, mostly sand. Moss is a good bedding to keep the heat up, but they still, in the in the end, they still are crabs, and they do come from the ocean. This has been another lesson of pet aquatics with yours truly, 
the thrills and gills himself.